Jakey on the Hawks. We've got a few out, so there's a little bit of nerves, but I'm confident we should be able to get it done. I'm here with a couple of the lads, boys. Hey, welcome back. How are we all? <laughs> Dude, what's going on, mate? Oh, I just... Uh... Not happy, I'm not happy at all. Yeah, well the cats, what's happened to the cat who's got smoked? They're done. I wasn't They're there done. today. I wasn't there, that's what I lost. I wasn't there. So, what, rebuild time you reckon? Uh, no, I like how we're playing the young youth at the moment, but long all season. Three of them. Long season. <laughs> uh, Bear Gebs, have you got a tip for this afternoon? Uh, uh, no, the D's will win, but hopefully it's close. There's only one real important in we're looking at looking at him warming up right there. Simon Blight, ready to go. Oh, my tip of the day, and uh, for those 18 above, Traka first half. Goal. First half. Yeah. Goal. But I reckon truck. D's by 11. Well, I agree with you. I reckon it's going to be tight. I'm going to tip the D's and I'm going to say by 17. Yeah. Can I just ask a question? Has there been any of the RG bargies left between you and your mate uh, Tommy Mitch at all? Yeah. There's been a couple of texts. No. There's been a couple of texts. So I might have to give you one if we get over the line. Yeah, definitely. Ice cream shout on Fast start from the Hawks, they've kicked the first two of the game very, very quickly. So, a little bit nervous here at the G, but uh, just backing us to settle in here. Need this, need to settle up. He's burnt wheat over the top. Fritata. Oh! Well done, Bailey Fritch. See McDonald's pounds. See McDonald's pounds. See Mac 31. Compared to that, see, oh. Let's go again. We can edit. Your mate, mate. <laughs> Connor McDonald crumbs and goals, and the Hawks are 3 5 23. These are 8, down by 15. C McDonald's on the board, gotta be happy for him. Happy for myself, actually. It's good to see my name up. Tommy McDonald has stolen halves his goal. He's marked it right on the line. He's gonna kick from direct. Yeah, yeah, Harms, he comes past. Gives him a little amble. He's kicked it, Tommy. So the D's. Are in front for the first time today. Already lining up from 55 out. We love the arc. We love the big right boot. He's been accurate this year with them. Come on, Gorney. Yes, Maxi Gorn. Half time here at the MCG, and the D's are up by nine points. Goal for goal at the minute. We can't quite get the break on them. It's a pretty good game of football, so pretty decent one for the neutrals. Uh, can't complain though. Pretty tight contest. Hawks are playing well. Hopefully the D's can bring it home in the second half. Because he kicks the first for the Hawks in the second half, and it's, it's back to a three point game. Hasn't been easy. Gorney's marked it and he's lining up again from outside 50. We love him from this. See Gorn goes paying from outside 50. The D's up by 16 points. He loves it from that side. Benny Brown's gotten a free directly in front. <laughs> this to kick it out to a 17 or a 15 point margin. He doesn't miss. Friend of the show, Sam Wiedemann. He'll be on the podcast this week. He'll be on Goes All Right. We need a goal. Need a goal, Sammy. Oh, yes. Yes, Sammy Wiedemann. Zarka kicks another one in the third, and the Ds are up by 33. All of a sudden, we've ground away, ground away, ground away, and we got the game on our terms. But the Hawks have been good up into this point. Hopefully, we can just crack the game open and put it to bed. Time here at the MCG. The Ds are up by 28 points, I believe. Can't complain with that term. That was the term where we get it on our terms and blow the margin out a little bit. It's probably, I don't want to go the early crow. I know Tommy Mitchell and Conor McDonald can turn it on, but um, I think we're probably home from here. So, so far, so good. Very professional performance, unless something silly happens in this last term. But the Hawks have been good. I respected how they've gone about it today, and I'm really impressed with the Ds as well. We faced some adversity this week, and I'm pretty stoked with how they've responded. So one quarter to go, and the Ds could be seven, seven and zip. Come on, boys. Mitchell is lining up for two in a row to reduce it to 16 points. Tommy Mitch. Seven and 
Zip, 13, 13, 91 to the Hawks, 11, 15, 81. They pushed us to be fair. I was very impressed with the Hawthorne Football Club this afternoon. Uh, but too strong, even though we're a little bit undermanned, Joel Smith went down as well. Uh, very impressed with the performance by the boys. It's a great block, it's a great base for the season to, get, to continue. Got the Sainers next week at the G, so it doesn't get any easier. But we'll take it, we'll absolutely take it. The game is done and dusted on the bridge home. Getting in the car and hitting the highway. I want to thank everyone for tuning into the vlog. I want to thank everyone for getting around the content, and I'll see you all very, very soon. Cheers.